In this video, I'm going to show you how you could use Neve to set up a different menu color on desktop versus mobile. So let's begin. First, we need to open the customizer by clicking on this link. Then click on header from the menu. Let's go to the primary menu component on the header builder at the bottom and click on this gear icon. On the left, let's click on the style tab. Okay, so here we have the styling options for the primary menu and we can see the color customization options over here on the left hand side. And we are going to keep these settings on the desktop version, but let's change it on mobile. So if we take a look at the bottom, we can see two tabs. The first one is desktop and we also have mobile on the right. Let's go ahead and click on the mobile tab. So in the preview, we can see the mobile header. We have the logo as well as the menu icon. We can also see these components in the header builder at the bottom. Now let's open the sidebar menu by clicking on the menu icon. So here we have our mobile menu with the same colors as the desktop version. Now you may be tempted to just click on the color on the left and make your change, but that will not work. So I'm gonna show you guys how it works. Let's click on this blank space here to add a new component. And we are gonna select the primary menu component. Now, if we take a look at the preview, we'll see that we have two different menus. Let's go ahead and remove the original one by clicking on this X. Okay, now let's drag our menu above the shopping cart. All right, so now we have our mobile menu. Let's go over to the style tab on the left to select our menu colors. This could be any color of your choice. I'm gonna make the items color black. Now let's move to the active item color. Let's select a pink or purple color. Let's go with this one. Let's change the items hover color. Let's make it a, a dark purple. I think this looks good. You can test your colors in the preview as well. Okay. And let's select a hover skin mode. Let's try it out. Okay. Once you're happy with your changes, you can go ahead and click on the publish button. Once you're done, you can go ahead and view your website. So here we have the original menu on desktop. And if we make this window smaller to simulate a mobile view, we'll see our mobile menu with the colors that we just configured. 